I think that she... I think she's someone that is still very much looking for approval and she very much wants to be liked and I think she really has this big sense of responsibility for her parents and taking care of her parents. And I think she sees the life that she has with them and at home and I think she's af she's afraid. I think she wants she wants more than that and I think that's a big driver in in the story. Um I think hmm She's very like me in that I feel she obviously lives in a world that's very similar to my world and the world we're living in here and now. And she, the way she dresses, the way that her manner, they're, they're all my mannerisms, a lot of my kind of like contemporary colloquial language I use, a lot of the way that I act around my friends, I brought to May to make her realistic. Um, but. I could never choose to do what May chooses to do because um, I already feel like I've opened up a lot of my life. The idea of opening up all of it and constantly being watched would be awful for me. Um, I find constantly being aware of having an audience is and having to sort of feel the need to perform in some way is really draining and I... I need downtime from that. I need time to recharge. I need time when I just feel like I can be myself and I'm not constantly being judged. Yeah. Mm, I think it's an amazing communicator. I think it spreads messages and ideas um, in a way that people can absorb it and take it in and and I like also that it kind of democratized art and ideas because anyone can market themselves now so anyone can post their work anyone can share an idea anyone can make their voice heard and I think that that's actually really amazing Well, I wanted to make sure that my accent was really flawless, so I spent a lot of time working with a dialect coach. I learned to kayak, and a big part of it was speaking, spending a lot of time talking to Dave Eggers, who wrote the book, and just really trying to understand the tech world, because it's kind of its own microcosm. It's kind of San Francisco and the tech industry is sort of its own planet, and I felt like I needed to yeah, understand it better. Mm. Yeah, I mean, I think the role is a very talky role. Most of what I do is have conversations. So for obviously for other roles, there's, it can be a bit more physical. I mean, for Belle, I had to really learn to horse ride and I had never ridden a horse before, so. Um, I had to really learn to waltz and I had never waltzed before. So I think this was more kind of an intimate way of exploring a role, more of a heady way of exploring a role, I guess, than, than others. Mm. Mm, that's an interesting question. I think Probably doing the bling ring was a turning point for me because it was the first time a director had given me the chance to do something so polar opposite to not only the characters I play but I think a part of my public persona and I think that it gave me a, it gave me a bit of a wider berth. It gave me some freedom. I think I also did a I did a comedy called. Um, this is the end, and I think getting to do something in a context that people hadn't expected was very freeing. Uh, and I think probably working um, within the feminist movement, working with UN women, f women's rights becoming a bigger part of what I was talking about publicly, I think that also started to, to shift things in a different way. I think studying too was a big thing, was going to university. Um, so yeah, there's been a few kind of, yeah, there's been a few. 
Oh, I worry about my ability to survive without Google Maps. I think everything else I could probably move to one side, but um, I've definitely come to rely on Google Maps for navigation in a way that is probably a bit troubling. <laughs> Uh, gosh, I think I've probably looked things up if people have told me, you know, I don't know, some, every now and again there's a particularly crazy rumour that I have to kind of uh, attend to. Most of the time I ignore, I ignore most of it, but every now and again there's something where I'm like, I probably have to say something about that. Do you like to share? You got the job at the circle. So, the Sarah project. They will be the first circle to share every single second of her work. Circle no sin service of Sky. Good morning, everyone. Hi. May you are a valued part of the circle. We can finally realize our potential. Do you feel ready? Soul Search can find Fiona Highbridge in under 20 minutes. You're such an enigma. You're most scared of unfulfilled potential. False modesty won't work here. You should be psyched. I know you meant well, but they started calling me a deer killer. Does this really seem okay to you? Hey, everybody. The perfect use of soul search. Let's find your friend. They can use it however they see fit. Everyone's data in the circle is being studied. Knowing is good, but knowing everything is better. It was a bad tool, a bad system. It can be fixed. Things at the circle, they need to change. Is there anything you want to tell us? The Circle.